everybody! I'm going to do this kind of summary tutorial on this look and it has this kind of pink eyeshadow on top and kind of a yellow a yellow color on the bottom and it just kind of reminds me of summer it's bright but again not over the top so it's definitely wearable sorry my hair looks horrible um <laughs> so I just really like this look um and I'm just going to get started right now so first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to use this painterly paint pot by MAC to prime my eye I'm going to put it all over the top, all throughout because I'm putting eyeshadow everywhere and a little under too to help hold the yellow. I'm going to use this is by Revlon. It's Cream Shadows. This is 711 Black Magic. There's a pretty pink in it that I'm going to use as kind of a base shadow. And I'm just going to put that all over my lid. And a little bit up here. Then I have this palette by um, CoverGirl. Upside down. This is called Blossoms. It has different pinks and purples in it. I'm going to take this pink right here. And this is going to go right on my eyelid. I'm going to take my Claire's palette and get kind of a white color here, which is right here, this one. And I'm going to take my crease brush here, dip that in, and this is going to go all kind of throughout here. I'm going to just kind of blend that out a little bit with the blending brush here. Then I'm going to take the pink that I used before from this one and I'm just going to add a little bit more because it got a little bit washed off with the whites and I'm just going to Tap it right here. I have this palette and just any white is fine. This is the one I have so I'm going to use it. Putting it on this brush and I'm going to highlight my brow bone and the corners of my eye. So this is just going to go right up through here. And then a little bit here. I'm going to use this flat brush to get that little corner with the white. I'm going to use this little flat brush. I'm going to put some yellow on. Here's my Claire's palette again. And I'm going to take first take this one. It's a little bit of a bright yellow. And this is going to go right under here. Take another darker yellow which I have this one right here. And I'm going to go over it some more. Because I really want that yellow to show up and pop because it's really unique. Take it all the way to the end here. Curve it all the way to here. And put on as much or as little of these colors as you want to for how bold or how conservative you're feeling that day. And then I'm going to go ahead and line my eyes. I have my hip gel liner in black. I'm 
going to take, this is a Revlon liquid eye pen. I just want to line the bottom a little bit. I don't generally recommend this eyeliner out of some other ones that are better. Then, I'm going to curl my lashes. I always squeeze and kind of keep pulsing it. Squeeze, squeeze, like that. And then I'm going to take my mascara. This happens to be the Benefit Bad Gal Lash, but any mascara is fine, of course. And And then the bottom slightly, quickly I should say, just click, click, and that's enough. Okay, and now the eyes are done. And I'm just going to take a blush. I have this Healthy Skin Blends by Neutrogena in these, it's called Fresh, number 20. It's really pretty, different colors you can swirl together. Get a nice glow here. And I'm just going to put it here, swirl here. a nice pop of pink. Then just going to take this MAC lip gloss in Viva Glam 5. It's a Roman numeral so it's hard to read for me. V15 I believe. No, 6. I don't know. Special edition. So any kind of pink gloss is fine. Whenever I do my eyes a little bit more. This is bold for me, but when I do them like this, I like to just kind of mostly do a gloss, but this is a really pretty color. And it is pretty pink, but the pink goes really nicely with the eyeshadow on the top, so it gives a really pretty kind of flu more fluid look more complete. Go! And... Ooh! I'm sorry, this is terrible here. Okay, so... Just... This is my look. I really hope you guys like it. I think it's so fun and just really summery and just really, it's so pretty. I just love it. So you can do so much with this look. I mean, any look you can wear for anything. It doesn't have to have a special tag. Oh, this is for prom. Oh, this is for roasting marshmallows. This is for doing my homework. <laughs> like, it can be for anything that you want it to be when if you just find some makeup that you like and wear it for what you want to. So thank you so much for tuning in. Bye.